Welcome! We're here in kosher.com's Kosher Kids Canvas Kitchen where we don't cook food, we draw food. I'm Mushki from Honorable Crafts, and this is my dearest friend, Mimi. Hi. We have something super duper in store. Oh, did I just say soup? You got it. A special treat. We are making a delicious Geffen noodle soup. Where do you think our soup canvas is hiding today? Maybe in the pot. Let's check it out. Oh. There it is. Oh, how cute. With the spork and the packets, delicious. All the ingredients you are going to need today is something to color on, a paper or canvas, a ruler if you're the measuring type, pen or marker or something to color with, and a pencil if you want to be a little extra careful today. And I forgot and a dash of creativity. You got it. So we are going to start with the shape of the top of the soup. So we're gonna make an upside down like kind of frown. Amazing. And now we're gonna make the sides of the soup but we're not gonna make it totally straight. We're kind of gonna make it coming in a bit. Do you wanna do it with the ruler? Whatever you want. Coming in a little bit that way and coming in a little bit this way. Close off the bottom with a little rounded smile shape. We are going to now make the other lid coming down on this canvas drawing. So we're gonna leave that there and we are going to go on now to the rest of the soup. Now two lines coming down and connect the bottom. I think we could start doing it with a marker now actually. I'm gonna do this with a marker. Now we're gonna write Geffen. So my little trick is whenever I write words, if I want it to be centered, I start with the middle letter. What's our middle letter today? F. F. So we're gonna draw the F. You could make it just a regular F, or if you want, you could do it in a bubble letter. I'm gonna go ahead and marker most of my drawing, not the top. I'm not gonna do that in marker yet because I still wanna draw all the noodles spilling over. I'm gonna make a little line, a little half rainbow shape over there and with tall triangles. We are gonna write noodle, but as you see, we're doing something really special. We're gonna turn the two O's into the eyes. I'm gonna do a fancy S. Turn my O's into eyes. And eyelashes. Little tongue. Oh, look how cute! We're gonna make little snakes coming down. Ready? All over. I'm gonna add a little bit of the top in between the pasta. Now I'm just gonna fill the rest of the noodle soup. With more noodles a bunch of lines to make it look very squishy. We're gonna draw a very big U 
for the spork, we're gonna make a parenthesis coming out. A very famous spork. Up and down, up and down. And we're gonna make a really cute face. We're gonna make two eyebrows on the set, on the side. He's more like, what? What's going on here? Two hands coming out. And little feet. Hmm. Notice the spork has a little line. Cut out because it opens and closes. Another spork. <laughs> so cute. Okay. Should we add the packets? Mm -hmm. All the details. Okay. So we're going to add one package. Let's see, just like this over here with a little zigzag on one side. And one is going to be hiding behind the soup. It's super shy. and label. Oh, oh, you made yours right near each other. That's so cute. Okay, this one's peeking out. Right there. Maybe. That is adorable. Is such a fun looking drawing. Oh, you made yours winking. I love when you add your own creative ideas. You don't even have to copy exactly. I am going to start coloring. Ready, Mims? Mimi, this is so cute. We can't wait to see what you came up with. Please send us a picture. And a very big thank you to our guest chef, Mimi, over here. Bye, Bye. and have a super duper day.